What's up, my single chats and Call of Duty refugees? Right now, a lot of the circus are getting very passionate. YouTubers are getting very passionate. Uh, you guys are getting very passionate as well because apparently we got some bad news about Call of Duty. Guys, in this clip, Dr. Disrespect goes bozo, okay? This is an absolute insane video. And no, you do not have to like or subscribe unless you want to, of course, you know? Bruh. But we're gonna get right into the story. Check this out. Wait for the clip because Charlie until goes around and they say, I think this is the worst Call of Duty update of all time. Warzone is broken. Multiplayer rank play launch now <laughs> delayed. <laughs> and they Look at that! Everybody's going off right now. Item shop still works, though. He means to say, like, this uh, BBC, right? Like, apparently... Apparently, the friendly UAV online, it's still purchasable. It still works. The shop still works, okay? If the game don't work, the shop still works, okay? That's what brother is trying to say. Uh, do not uh, try this at home. Another guy pointed out that, what? You're not enjoying the new screen change feature because uh, he's saying, yeah, you know what I mean? Like, we ended up getting the new uh, screen change feature. Three years, 3,000 devs. The game, game got nothing new other than maybe one new map that recently got added in Modern Warfare 3. All the maps were already made. All the way back in 2011, I'm talking about the original Modern Warfare 3 and 3,000 devs, guys. This is the content we're getting. X Define devs rubbing their hands right now, dropping Lamau emojis. At least we can still buy bundles in the store. That's right. That's that. That's what we all love to hear, right? That's what we love to see. And you can see everybody's going down. Yeah, 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 yeah. That chick showing mommy milkers out here. Breaking Modern Warfare 3 multiplayer rank play launch is now delayed, guys. Give it up for these suckers out here because. These devs got nothing. They don't know what to do. These things are all ESG score. Nothing. They're all about them rainbows, right? Like strong, independent, no, 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 man. No, 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 man. They're all about them. But guys, roll this one. Check Champs, this out. I don't. I I think That's I had install after, after today. The worst days. Oh, huh? I don't. Feel like playing this fucking game anymore i just go kick I, I spoiler been... alert he's actually playing the game right now no he started playing after this clip so yeah i've i've experienced it all and i'm dead serious when i say this oh huh? oh huh? i am legit dead serious when i say this i think we uninstall the game and we just don't play it anymore after uh, today. spoiler alert he's currently playing the game and i don't blame the homie right wait for it it is built for 85 year old men oh, it's damn. uninspiring i don't know if you saw the yeah. latest on what they're doing with warzone but th they're adding extraction points during the middle of the br obviously probably taking a look at dead drop going fuck man we don't we can't create any we don't we're not creative we got to look at somewhere else right so they're they're trying like they they are struggling to come up with a good experience for their Call of Duty franchise. It's pretty it's, it's like every year, right? Like every it's pretty year. Pretty kind apparent. Of thing. It's just throw shit in there and see what works and see what doesn't. Damn. Right. I mean Doc is spitting mad facts right now. These are facts, no printer. But here's the thing, man. Do you think streamers are the problem? Do you think YouTubers are the problem? <laughs> Do you think you are the problem? Oh, shit. Do who do you think is the problem? Who do you, who who you think is the problem for Call of Duty? Do you think it's the streamers, YouTubers, you, me, <laughs> or or actually the devs? Is it the devs? Is it Activision? Is it Sledgehammer by Boss? Is it Infinity Targ? Is it Treyarch? Who do you think, oh, and what you think is the real problem? Because right now, X Defiant, I should be having that video already out on the channel where we talk about the fact that uh, X Defiant, and wait for the next clip that's coming up, guys. X Defiant, uh, I believe Mark Rubin, who was initially the face of Modern Warfare 3, the original one, uh, all the way back in 2011, he came forward and he says that there is not gonna be skill-based matchmaking in, in X Defiant. Oh, shit. Oh. There will be for the new people Bruh. but till rank 25 i mean that is th that is a genius idea I, I would love to see and this is something that we talked about on the channel million times right we also have i also did say that brad like forget about level 25 make it prestige one or Bruh. something like that where if you are a new player or even if you're a pro player whoever you are right you pick up a new call of duty game you put it on your playstation 5 your sony pony your xbox or pc uh forget about pc you got a lot of cheaters there now so, but yeah absolutely but whatever you play on right you start playing and till you get to prestige one that's the thing we, we don't have prestige you know see i forgot I'm, i keep forgetting we don't even have prestige so let's just say rank 50. so till rank 50 
you have skill-based matchmaking and after that you don't have skill-based matchmaking how about that like the video if you agree like the video if you agree it's so bad i am falling a fucking sleep mm. i'm falling asleep mm. i can't stay interested in playing a video game yeah. think about that for a second how many of you guys did not buy the game but you're still watching how many of you guys did not buy the game? Like, I, I want to know. I did not buy the game and I was saying this, guys. Till January, February, I will see what's happening in the community and then I'll buy. This is something that I said all the way back. Uh, and when the game, the beta came out, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. If you have been around for that long, you, you know, right? Like I said that and right now... <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm not buying the game, bro. Like, I, I guess it's Joe, bro. It's done, so I'd buy the game, bro. I, I'm not buying the game. Maybe if Treyarch's next Call of Duty game is good, then I'll, I'll get into it, but I'm not buying, bro. Like, back in the 90s, no point. when you'd be sitting on those little beanbags, looking up at your big old 32 inch tube TV, playing on a Sega Genesis 32X, little NBA Jam Tournament Edition, Mortal Kombat 2. Double Dragon, Stealth, Punisher, Sonic Pinball. Yeah. I had a great time. Mm. Video <laughs> games used to be so fun. <laughs> Online. Man, who would have thought that a dude in a wig with sunglasses and doors yeah. would be spitting mad facts, man. Give it up for Dr. Disrespect, man. Doc is a legend, bro. Doc is a legend. He's playing the game right now. He's back playing the game, and he also did say when Nick Merckx and Tim the Tatman skin was removed by Activision in Call of Duty, right? He said that he will not play the game. He said he said that he will not play the game, but then he started playing. Today he says that he's gonna uninstall and not play. And guess what? He's already playing the game. So we tolerate too much bullshit now. I agree. That's the problem. I agree. And we just kind of like fuck it. We'll just deal with it. Yeah. Says that while playing the game. <laughs> Now, Bumbaka. now listen guys, don't take it as an attack a doc. I love the guy. Genuinely, genuinely. Obviously, this is a YouTube video, so we're keeping a little bit of sarcasm here. But but the fact but but also this is a fact, right? He's saying the truth that you and I agree with. I agree with what he's saying, but he's saying that while playing the game. We're tolerance. Uh we're a lot more tolerant, and that's the fact. As gamers, we are a lot more tolerant to unfinished messes, microtransactions, the $20, $30 bundles, the BBC bundles, games with no new content. We're really tolerant, but but he's saying that while playing the game. I, I don't want to deal with bullshit. I wanted to have a nice, fun, pure experience. What kind of bullshit do we have in Halo days? If you're two bar, three bar, whatever, yellow yeah. bar, you know? As well Those were game. games were whatever, but just, but, but like uh, that uh, and <laughs> what else? Guys, click on this video on the screen because this is an absolute insane clip that was caught on camera in 4K. Sigas are juicing around, Sigas are cheating left and right, and this game, this entire franchise has been infested by it. Check this out and I'll see you 